Hello, my name is Jordi Sanzano and, and I'm recording this video just to demonstrate the LHLA Simple Life platform. So here in GitHub you can find a, a very simple guide on, uh, that describes everything that needs to be installed in a virtual machine, in this case an EC2 machine, just to run this uh, live, low, live HLA slow latency platform. It's basically three binaries. The first one is obviously FFM break, and the second one is Go TS Segmenter and Go Chinese Streaming Server. The three of them are open source tools, and here explains uh, in this guide with a lot of detail how to install it. I'm going to assume that you already launched an EC2 instance, that you already installed those three binaries, and I'm going to start from there. So in my demo, I'm going to use a T2X Lash because uh, we will be using, uh, we will be doing uh, transcoding of, uh, of an HD uh, source, so we need a little bit of transcoding power there. And just a tip, do not forget to open uh, those three ports, 1935 for RTMP input and 1994 for HLS output or STTP HLS output and 22 for um, SSH. So I already SSH this, uh, that machine twice and I have two DMAX sessions uh, created in that machine. So I'm going to attach this window to the first session. And this is the directory of the segmenter. <coughs> and then I'm going to attach the second window to the second session, DMAX session. So, and here is the streaming server. So the web server. So first of all, I'm going to start the web server. After that, I'm going to start the streaming, uh, the go, the, sorry, the chat and the segmenter. So with a multi rendition profile. So and I'm going to say it's going to be live, not test. Okay, everything is up and running. In this other screen, I have an OBS with the following settings. So this is, as you can see, points to that uh, port 1935 of that machine with my super secret uh, stream key. And here you can see the encoding settings, so uh, video encoding settings, x 64 CDR, 8 megabit, uh, one second go, and uh, zero latency. Because what we try to achieve here is low latency. So let's start the streaming. So this should start streaming. Okay, nice. We are receiving data and we are also sending data to the web server. So now let's connect the player. For, as a player, I'm going to be using Safari. And uh, let me just try to type the IP. I think it's this one. Uh, it seems yeah, it works as well. So okay, here we have OBS just sending this uh, this counter or this uh, time. And here at the other side, uh, so this is an set to this two machine. It's transcoded. It's an EDR, an EDR is created, and the two renditions from that EDR are sent to this player, uh, to the Safari player, so to the exact Safari player that, come with, that comes with your Mac OS. So if we just uh, create a screenshot and take a look, we will see that uh, that here there is about two seconds latency. So, and that's all. That is all uh, that I wanted uh, to demo. Thanks a lot for your time.